Brooklyn Independent Television. If you were lucky enough to be minimally impacted by Superstorm Sandy, life is already back to normal. But there are many trying to get back to stability and rebuild after the devastation, all with varying degrees of aid. Sheepshead Bay is one community that's still fighting that fight. Tatiamara has the story. Six months after Hurricane Sandy, the waterfront community of Sheepshead Bay is still struggling to get back on its feet. Sandy basically devastated the community. Homes were destroyed, businesses were destroyed. The community now is struggling to come back. And the biggest hurdle? Money, 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 money. Money is the major problem right now. Whether it's a residential um, a unit that needs more money to get their home up and running, or a business. Right now, the major problem across the board is money. The insurance companies are not paying. FEMA is not giving enough money. Everyone keeps saying the federal dollars are on their way, but we have not seen them as of yet. Part of the federal dollars approved January of this year are indeed in the pipeline, but there are concerns over who will qualify for the help. Everything that is going with these federal dollars is income-based, truly biased. The chances of someone in this community getting these loans and grants is slim to none. But one local business is moving on with or without help. Thank God, you know, we open in exactly two months before New Year, you know, December 30th, we reopen the place. Sal is the owner of Mazal Cafe on Emmons Avenue, which was completely flooded by Hurricane Sandy. You know, when the main door is broken, when the water came in the lobby like too much water, then we left from window. Before fleeing through the window, Sal managed to capture video of water rushing into his restaurant. This was the water at the front door and lobby. And this is what the lobby looks like on a normal day. This was the water coming in at the entrance of the cafe. And here's what the entrance looks like now. Just to give clear context, the water outside of the restaurant had risen to almost six feet high. After the storm, absolutely everything in the restaurant from sofas to fixtures was ruined. But instead of giving up like many local business owners, Sal decided to renovate right away and get back to business. Just, you know, next day I decided to do renovation and the second day we start the demolition. And all the work was accomplished with borrowed money from friends. We had good insurance, but they didn't take care of us. And um, FEMA is offering SBA loan, but that loan is very difficult, you know, too much paperwork. Now that his business is up and running, things are slowly getting back to normal. We are going well. And we, we, are, we love customers, we love neighborhood, and people love this place. And we never lose you know, our hope. And everything is from God, everything ha has some reason. And just we have to think uh, positive, we have to look forward. In Sheepshead Bay, for Brooklyn Review, I'm Tati Amara. Watch this and other Brooklyn Independent Television episodes online at brickartsmedia.org slash BIT.